The film starts showing a boy Nick and his two friends Jonah and Haley. Actually, they were the students of MIT. Haley is shifting to California for one year. So her two friends plan a trip along with her. Later it is shown that the legs of Nick were stable a few years ago. Then his legs begin to weaken due to some sort of disease. So he has to use the crutches. One day while they were on the trip, three of them stay in a hotel during the night. Nick receives a message from a hacker named Nomad. In fact, this hacker had hacked the MIT server recently. He has tried to entrap the three of them. Somehow, they remain protected. Nick and Jonah also receive threatening mail. He even hacks the laptop of Haley. Actually, he wants to irritate them by hacking. He was provoking them. Then both friends trace his location. His location was showing in the state of Nevada. Now they both are happy about this. Because they had to go, passing through that way. It is obvious, their mission will be easy. They drive their car to Nevada in the morning. They stop at a filling station on the way. It is observed here that Haley was very worried. Because she was thinking, that Nick wants to make distance from herself by sending her to California. Then Nick, tells her that his leg muscles are not functioning properly. As a result, I am using the crutches. And I will be totally in the wheelchair after some time. So I don't want to spoil your future, maintaining a bond with me. Hearing it Haley becomes very sad. And she begins to weep. Then they leave to search the location of the hacker. But the night falls before they reach there. Finally, they detect the hacker's location in a desolated cabin. Then Nick and Jonah ask Haley to wait in the car. And they move inside the house, holding the torches and the cameras. But they find no one there. Then they hear the shouting sounds of Haley. Then they hurriedly move to their car. To their dismay, Haley goes missing. They both get tensed. At the same time, Nick hears a voice, he notices that someone is pulling Haley from upside. Suddenly, a sharp bright light emits from there. And three of them disappear from there. Finally when Nick restores his senses, he finds himself in a wheelchair at a research facility. That place looks technologically very advanced. All the people present there have worn protective suits. After some time, we see a doctor asking some questions from Nick. Nick senses that he is not getting enough strength to move. So he asks the doctor, what is going on with us? The doctor tells on it that, you have been tested positive for the extraterrestrial biological entities. The signals that had been mailed to you by that hacker nomad were not normal signals but they were alien signals. They had been sent to you through a message. So my team had taken you here to inquire you about it. But Nick does not understand a single word from him. He says that I want to meet my friend. But that doctor also forbids Nick to meet with his friend. Afterwards, that doctor leaves from there. Then Nick sees numbers 32441 as tattoos on his arm. But Nick does not get any idea about them. Then he was being shifted into another room. Then he catches the sight of a clock which was stopped with time 1230. Meanwhile, Nick observes Haley lying senseless in a room. Observing her, Nick gets more worried. After some time, that doctor again comes to meet him. Where he begins to ask very mysterious questions from Nick. Do you have 10 fingers? Do you belong to Earth? Are you terrestrial? Nick is just confused by hearing these questions. Why is he asking so plain and uncomplicated questions? Then that doctor also shows Nick the recorded video on his camera. Where he observes an alien behind a tree. Nick is left shocked, seeing it. When he is alone, then he hears the voice of Jonah. In fact, his friend is in his adjoining room. Nick's friend tells him, these people are not letting us go outside. And I am feeling something strange in my body. I think these people are conducting an experiment on us. But Nick does not consider it as such. The next day, that doctor comes to Nick once again to take his test. Where it is observed that Nick's brain starts to function much better. Then that doctor begins to smile. It appears as if he has succeeded in some mission. When Nick goes to see Haley, then he takes a page from that register. Returning to his room, he begins to sketch the map of this location. Because he was planning to escape from there. 
and he also informs this plan to Jonah. Then Jonah alerts him that they are experimenting on our bodies. It means they are putting something in our bodies. As a result, I am feeling my hand numbed. But Nick does not believe in it. Then it is seen that, a cow was being put under experimentation in another place of the research facility. But some activity starts there. Due to this, the security alarm of that place is activated. Then it is known by the announcement that one of the subjects has escaped from here. Due to this, people get scared there. Then Nick, notices that something has damaged the walls of that place. After that, Nick meets that doctor. Then the doctor asks him, are you sensing your legs? Nick does not respond to it. Nick inquires about Jonah from the doctor. Then the doctor tells him that, we did not bring your friend here. Hearing this, Nick gets upset because he had talked to him before. Then Nick attempts to flee from there along with Haley. But that doctor becomes aware of it. Nick reaches the exit with much effort. But his hand could not access the lock of the door. Then the doctor's team capture them and lock in a facility room. Then the doctor's team tries to take Nick with them forcibly, but Nick falls down from the bed during the struggle. Then Nick observes that, his both legs have been replaced with an artificial body using alien technology. Noticing it, Nick is worried and confused. Then he restores his courage in some way. Using his new legs, he starts to run along with Haley from there. When he enters the elevator, the doctor also comes there. The doctor tells him that he will be in danger if he goes out from here. But Nick ignores each of his words and comes outside by passing through a tunnel. Now Haley also restores her senses. After this, they take a lift from a lady. And they stop near a club. Nick goes inside to seek out help, leaving Haley outside. Nick tries to use the phone of that place but the signals were creating issues. Then TV starts to broadcast their news of elopement. At the same time, a man tries to escape in a truck, abducting Haley. Nick attempts to stop the truck so that he could rescue his friend. Meanwhile, the truck driver throws Nick down. This makes Nick very aggressive. Now he begins to run fast with the limbs of alien technology. He reaches the truck in a few seconds. Meanwhile, Haley also restores her senses and points the gun at that truck driver. Then they both drive away in his truck, leaving that man there. The doctor along with his team move from there to catch them. The lady who has given a lift to two of them is also seen with the doctor. Then the doctor asks her about those two. As the lady had come under their influence, she also behaves in a strange manner. Then Nick checks that their path has a dead end now. Due to this, both start to worry. Then Nick begins to search for another route. But they come back to the same place again. Nick observes a visitor center there. Then they both enter there to check it. Where they find the map of this area. But the strange fact was this, there was only one road. Then they both decide to stay at that place at night. Then some military force arrives there searching for them. So they begin to hide. They also find Jonah there. He was hiding there wearing a protective suit. Later, the doctor meets with the owner of the truck and asks about Nick and his friend. But that man also begins to act mysteriously. Because he had also come under their influence. Then the doctor kills him with his gun. On the other side, Nick notices the same number tattoos on the neck of Haley. Then Haley tells him that they are experimenting with something on both of us. At this time, we are in Area 51. Because the tattoos numbers 235 and 41 on our body, which are equal to 51 if we add them. Now Area 51 is actually the top secret military base of the US. It is also known that there are some aliens who are making some secret plans. But Nick was not ready to believe in it. Jonah also reveals that, he was feeling as if they have taken something out of his body. Then he shows his hand to Nick, which has been replaced with the body part of alien technology by them. The next day, the three of them drive the truck on the same route. After traveling some distance they encounter a military checkpoint. Jonah tries to escape from there taking the truck, but they get struck by a big pillar. Due to this, their truck neither goes forward nor backwards. Consequently, they all three are entrapped there. Then Jonah enters the military system room to rescue Nick and Haley. He begins to hack their system by going there. 
but the military personnel starts firing at him. Then an explosion causes due to firing. Now Jonah is badly wounded. The glasses and the system also get damaged due to the explosion. So he could not perform any action on the system. Jonah thinks to sacrifice himself here. And he approaches the truck facing the firing of guns. He gets injured badly. And his strength also reduces due to injuries. Then he says to Nick to stay in the truck. Nick was not willing to leave his friend there alone. He becomes very emotional for his friend. But he agrees with his friend advice under compulsion. And goes into the truck. Then Jonah damages that pillar with his leftover strength. Due to this, Nick drives away that truck, pulling from there. They too feel very dejected and sentimental after seeing Jonah's sacrifice. While they were crossing a bridge they encounter that doctor along with his entire military force. Witnessing it Nick gets worried. Now they puncture their truck tires. Which makes their truck face a fatal accident. As a result, they both are wounded badly. Then a helicopter lands there and takes Haley from there. Nick stands up, restoring his courage. Observing that, the doctor understands, that Nick is getting the ability to control his strength. Then the doctor says to him that he cannot reach Haley. And he is a perfect creation of human and alien technology. This is the biggest achievement for us. Then Nick observes the name of that doctor with concentration. Which turns to be Nomad, when it is read upside down. Now Nick understands that the hacker is none other than the doctor. Then the doctor says to Nick, I did as such so. Because it is your mistake. As you had come here to search me. Nick becomes sentimental and furious while recalling Haley which results in the activation of superpower, which makes his legs speed up as they are made of alien technology. As a result, he begins to run swiftly. All of a sudden, he is hit with an invisible wall. Passing through it, he enters another unique world. Then the doctor also comes there and takes off his helmet. It is revealed here that doctor is also not a human being. But he is a robotic alien, his only face resembles humans. While the whole body is similar to the aliens. Nick is shocked, seeing it. With close attention, Nick comes to know. That he is not in any research facility but in an alien spaceship which was numbered as 235 and 41, which indicates Area 51.